A health care provider in Kelloland has seen an increase in people struggling with alcohol and substance abuse during the pandemic. Kelloland's Kelly Volk looks into the issue and a few ways you can help. Stress over the pandemic is one of the factors linked to the uptick in alcohol and substance use, according to Avera's manager of addiction services. So there's just so many different elements of stress that have played into the lives of, of our community members, too, from financial stresses, um, stress with employment, um, stress with, with school and kids and relationships. So it just it kind of goes on and on and just um, um, keeps going going further further out. An event this weekend is aimed at preventing drug addiction and overdose deaths. This Saturday is the Drug Enforcement Administration's annual Prescription Drug Take Back Day. The Sioux Falls Police Department's lobby will be open from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. for you to drop off any unused medications. If we can get rid of those, then we can eliminate a lot of the problems because there is a, a problem nationwide with people abusing medication, and this is one area that it's basically people obtain it is stealing it, whether it's from uh, friends or relatives. If we have those medications, they're no longer needed. We have a place that you can safely dispose of them. The department's drop-off is also available Monday through Friday. And if you or someone you know is struggling with addiction, there are resources that can help. Please reach out to help right now because we're, we're here and we're available. In Sioux Falls, Kelly Volk, Kelloland News. Now, we've included some helpful resources in the story on Kelloland.com. Meanwhile, law enforcement all over Kelloland will be taking part in the drug take back, bro take back program from 10 to 2 on Saturday. And you can also find your closest drop-off site by visiting this story.